way you judge if people will pay for it is when they pay for it. Yeah, How's that? Right. Yeah, exactly. Credit card testing is a great way. This video is brought to you by Procopia Law, the recommended law firm of Founders Floor. So one, one example in, in my career, um, I'll get this from Amazon days. You know, when we were doing eBooks, uh, you know, Jeff, he's, he was a really smart guy. You know, he said, we're not gonna do subscriptions. You don't go to Barnes and Noble and subscribe to books, you know? People don't do that. That's not really how people buy books. You, you buy the book and you don't pay for the, the delivery, the truck delivery, you just buy the book. It's all included, right? You didn't pay to, for the guy to deliver it and put it on the shelf and all that stuff and just bought the book. So that was the model. So using a familiar mental model that people are used to doing, that makes sense. For example, another service that I've been involved with called Mimeo Send, which was you could send a bundle of files of any size to anyone in the world for 10 cents. And it would get there securely and it was like FedEx. You would get a return receipt and you would get it delivered and you'd know it was delivered, you know when it was delivered and all that stuff. And nobody's doing that, you know? That's a model that could work. So that's an idea for some of you guys out there. Uh, a delivery service that is like FedEx for files. Um, so use a mental model that people understand. If you try to change the model, then you're gonna get resistance.